Hey, what is going on everybody? It is Mystify here, back with another Annoying Thing Skate 3 Players Say, Episode 2. Well, you guys really love me ranting about stuff, so I decided to make another one, and we did hit 50 likes. So I'm gonna make it a little bit harder, harder on you this time. If we get, like, I don't know, like, 150 likes, because the last episode got 100 likes, if we can get that, then I will make a Part 3. So, I hope you guys enjoy. If you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for daily videos. And as always, have a great day, guys. Bye. The first thing I want to talk about probably pisses me off the most out of everything. Say I join, like, a live stream on Skate 3 because I am a big fan of Skate, so I go on Twitch sometimes and I just type in Skate 3 to see who's streaming it, and sometimes I even join their game if they're cool and I just like, play with them because I'm bored, right? Well, 9 times out of 10, they're like, oh my god, bro, you should join in Rise, bro, you should join Rise. Just every second, every time, on my YouTube comments, I get comments like, oh my god, bro, join Rise, Rise Mystify confirmed? It, I mean, no offense to Rise or anybody in it, because there are some fabulous, and I love most of the people in Rise, but if, if you're a good Skate 3 player, you don't automatically have to join Rise. I mean, come on. I'm pretty sure I can speak to, like, everyone who isn't in Rise. If you're good at Skate 3, and people are like, oh my god, bro, are you in Rise? Do you 420 blaze it every day? I'm pretty sure they just get so disrespected, because they're pretty much just, like, saying kill yourself. If you're not in like a Skate 3 team, I mean, oh my god kids, can we just calm down with all of the Rise talk every second? The second thing I'm going to talk about, I kind of touched on it just a little bit in my last episode, but this is going to be the graphics, kids. Alright guys, it's 2016, why are you going around with a shirt that says, tell your girlfriend to call me? I mean... If you just now picked up Skate 3, I mean, like, I can, I kind of understand, like, why you think they're so cool, but just stop it. I mean, like, it's 2016, can we just get over the graphic shirts? It doesn't make you cooler. You know what I think when I join a public spot battle match, and I see somebody with the X7 Albert Blaze It 420 t-shirt, or I see a guy that's like, tell your girlfriend to call me. Like, they probably think that I think that they get, like, so much, like, so many girls and stuff. But honestly, they look like the most complete random people ever. If you do this, please stop it. Because, I mean, like, I mean, I'm not going to tell you how to dress on Skate 3 because it's not that serious. But in my opinion, I think it looks way cooler if you just dress without graphics i'm pretty sure you're like trying way too hard if you have x7 albert best trick liner awesome albert 360 graphics with rainbows on your back but that's just my opinion people who absolutely have no idea between trick lining and comp and this really makes you mad if you're a comp player or maybe even a trick liner but like when you practice doing something so much and then you just join a game like for instance i join a public spot battle match maybe i'm a comp player i'm just doing my thing copping it out you know you know how we do out here on the streets just kidding but say you're doing comp or whatever, and then you hear an annoying noise, and then you look down in your game chat, and there's this one guy that's called like X7 Albert Master 420 Trickliner, right? So this Albert Master 420 Trickliner guy's like, Trickliner, Trickliner, Trickliner. And 9 times out of 10 guys, the people who say that, you can just tell that like they can't do it. Like, I'm, I'm sorry I don't want to be rude. But, like, most of the time, the only reason they say that is because they can't do it. And that's not even the big thing about it. Like, they just yell trickliner, trickliner, when there's a big difference. And if you practice doing something so much, like comp or trickliner, when someone gets it wrong, it's just like, it's just like disrespect, you know? I mean, like, I'm making it sound a lot more than it is. But, like, you know what I mean? Like, if you work hard learning something, you want people to actually know what it is and not, like, get two completely different things mixed up. But, yeah, so they, most of the time, they don't know which is trick lining or comp. Thank you guys for watching episode two of Annoying Things Skate 3 Players Say. If you guys did enjoy, make sure to leave a like. 
I'm not really too sure if I can find enough things to make another episode, but if we do hit that goal, I will try to eventually make one. And uh, yeah, so remember, take all of the stuff that I, I said in the video with a grain of salt because it is just my opinion and I could be very wrong. But I hope you guys enjoyed regardless, and as always, have a great day guys. Bye.